Hi, internet viewers. I'm Brent, and welcome to my gem cutting channel. Uh, I'm cutting citrine today in a triangle shape. I've got a real nice piece of citrine here, dopped up and ready to go. And I'm going to be cutting this uh, triaga design. I was looking for a, a triangle design that doesn't have sharp corners because they are they're prone to chipping. So I looked this one up, and uh, it looks like it's very promising. So I, I've gotten started here cutting the pavilion and I'm cutting to a center point first and uh, later I'll start cutting the the uh, brake facets and also the girdle facets at 90 degrees as you can see here I've still got a little more cutting to do I have a couple of low spots that need some more cutting so uh, putting on a 3000 disc this is a diamond topper disc I'm going to use that uh, before that I had used a 600 grit lap and, uh, once I've gotten those facets cut the way I wanted I've changed to a copper pre-polishing disc and I will pre-polish these pavilion facets and I'm doing the final polishing now I'm using a an ultra lap a, a thin plastic disposable film lap to do these polishing facets and here we look uh, all finished polishing it looks pretty good right now I was real happy the way this uh, stone polished up. Alright, I'm going to go ahead and transfer this gemstone. As you can see, I started off with wax, but I'm using two-part epoxy glue for the transfer. And then I'll simply heat the uh, wax to release that. And uh, I'm starting on the crown here. Everything's going according to plan with no problems. Uh, uh, I had good luck cutting this Triaga design and I'm going to use it many times, I, I hope, in the future here. I'm using an Ultratech V2 fasting machine with a dis digital angle display. Uh, I've, I'm cutting the crown facets now, or actually polishing them. I've, I'm on the last couple of steps of cutting this gemstone. My angle set 45 degrees and a 45 degree table adapter installed in the quill. And here we are, we've finished the stone and I've cleaned it up. And I was very happy with the way this turned out had no problems at all it polished very well and uh, it's very brilliant too I'm really happy with the whole whole stone this is about a two to three carat gemstone This is a very nice piece of rough that I had. There's a couple more shots of it still outside uh, with different background grounds to give it a little different color and uh, the light it makes it change a little bit in the way you view it. And then we're going to try it here on the turntable and see how that does. still trying to work through my lighting problem in my workshop. Uh, I know I need to buy a couple more LED lamps 
so I can get some better photography here, but uh, for now it's going to have to just do the way it is. This is one of the best pieces of citrine I've had in quite some time. It's not too, too light and it wasn't too dark. It was a medium citrine. I was very happy with it. All right. Uh, thanks for watching and please subscribe to my channel for more videos.